Hey YouTube, this is Samir Matani here for Stack 96 and in this video I'm going to show you how to root then install Oxygen OS on your OnePlus One. So before you do this you want to make sure that you back up your phone because doing this basically involves wiping your phone and starting from scratch. And if you want to see how to back it up, be sure to click on the link in the description down below. I'll click on the card that should either be up there or I think on the menu bar on mobile phones where it will basically bring you to the same video. So first thing you want to do is you want to download the OnePlus One Toolbox as well as Oxygen OS itself from the link down in the description. And this toolbox basically has everything you need to unlock your bootloader as well as root your phone and basically install this thing. So while those are downloading, be sure to go to your phone, go to settings, scroll down to about phone and then scroll down to build number. Now keep tapping on it until it says developer options are enabled. Now go back, go into developer options now scroll down until you see Android debugging and tap on it. Once this is all done, shut down your phone and then press on the power button and the volume up button at the same time and it should bring you into something called fast boot. Now on your computer after the toolbox is finished downloading, go and um, double click on it and then go and extract it. And you should be able to find it in the C folder, so go to the C folder, go to OPPO and then tap on oppotoolbox.exe. Under this you should see all of the options and basically from here you want to make sure that your phone's plugged into your computer and then you want to unlock the bootloader. After you do this the whole phone is wiped and after a while it should bring you um, back to basically the screen that you get when you first buy your phone and it's just brand new. Once you get to the screen you just want to keep skipping and nexting until you get to the end and then once you get to the end you want to shut it down again and then do the same thing, press the power button and the volume up button. And now this time once you get to fast boot, on your PC you want to go and install the recovery that's called TWRP recovery and then press flash and this will basically flash it onto your phone so you can use this recovery. And after you've done that go to reboot and then system and then it will basically reboot the system. Once your phone's switched on, you want to again connect it to the computer and now you want to drag and drop Oxygen OS from the downloads folder onto your phone. Although make sure you extract it first because it's basically a zip within a zip. I don't know why they did it like this but that's how they did it. So extract it and then drag it on. And then once it's all copied onto your phone then just basically shut down your phone. And then when you're starting it up instead of pressing the volume up button and the power button you want to press the volume down button and the power button. Because this will basically um, boot it into recovery instead of booting it into fast boot. Once your phone opens up in recovery mode, you want to go to install and then you want to find wherever you saved um, Oxygen OS on your phone. And then just keep tapping on it until you get to the zip folder and then swipe to flash it. And then you just have to wait for a bit. It does take a while and don't worry if it seems to get stuck for ages. But after a while you should finally get to the end and then it should ask you to reboot and it will basically reboot into um, Oxygen OS. And that's about it. You've now got Oxygen OS and your phone's also rooted, which is an added bonus for the future. If you like this video, be sure to give it a like. If you have any comments or you have any questions, because I'm pretty sure you might, you'll have loads of questions from this, because it is a pretty complicated process, be sure to ask them down below in the comment section. And of course, if you want to see more things like this, be sure to subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next video. Thank you for watching and see ya.